Hi guys, it's Dawn from Let's Make a Mess today. How are you doing? Oh, let me plug in my phone real quick. There, just in case. Um, I wanted to do a little haul. I've been in Santa Barbara all day with my daughter. Oh, I had so much fun today, you guys. I mean, oh my gosh. I, I needed my fix with my kid. And so I feel so much better um, after I see her and I get her things that she needs and I tuck her in and, you know, I, I just, yeah, I, I just totally enjoy hanging out with my kid. So, I mean, you know, she's just awesome. So I picked up these. They're name tags. They're Hallmark. They look very old-fashioned to me. Um, Kansas City, Missouri, self-adhesive, um, 88. I mean, maybe, maybe that's a year. I don't know. But they look 88, don't they? So, but they're Hallmark, and they're just tags. And I don't know how many is in here, but I, I think I have a use for these. And I just I thought they were so pretty and springy, right? Very springy and yellow. So I picked those up at a thrift store. I don't remember which one because we went to a few. But now this is going to be kind of mixed up, you guys. Okay, this is like a mixed up, a mixed up. Um, so we went, we went to a few. But look, this was probably one of my favorite finds today. Somebody, somebody made this. And... For being, for being cheeks, it says, love many ruinations. Huh, I don't know, but 99 cents, you guys, for this beautiful clay pitcher, which is not a pitcher in my world. It's a utensil holder because I love using these things for my, um, for my, art supplies. I, I love, I love, I love it. Love it, love it, love it. So I got that and I bought some of these um, pipe cleaners because have you guys checked out Helen Wyatt yet? I shared her on Facebook. She's that little, she's a little lady out of Georgia and she is so great. I mean, she goes outside, she plays with her Georgia sand and her Portland cement, and she makes pots. And this with some, with some of these she made, why am I yelling? With some of these she made um, some crystals with some borax. Now, I don't know if I'm ever gonna get around to making some crystal from borax, but I've got the pipe cleaners now if I do. I didn't have any pipe cleaners. So I got that there. Okay, I think that's all I got at the thrift store, thrift store. Because, let me see though, let me make sure. What's this? Oh, no. What is this? Oh, I think this is it. Oh, this was at like an outside market thing. Oh, I had to get this. So this is the Om sign. If you're like, if Buddha. And I found these beautiful, um, these are a dollar a piece. But I thought these would make really cool, um, Oh, I feel like I'm going to sneeze with all the dust still. Um, with all the, um, this would be book covers, right? I don't know, but whatever. I just had to have these. And I bought my kids some really cool, like, pants there, you know, like flowy legs. And um, so we got those, and that was a lot of fun. And then what else did we get there? So she got that. Oh, and I was asking if he had a, a bead, bead, um, like that he could like give me, you know, or sell me cheap. And he had some, but he weren't, they weren't cheap. And I was like, no thanks. So yeah, any everything else in here is just stuff that you don't need to see. Okay, so then, so you guys can see that I didn't find a lot at the thrift store. You know, this was my favorite find at the thrift store. She did. She found a cute scarf, and she found some cute couple pairs of shorts, a cute top. Um, what else did she find? Just all kinds of stuff. Can't pop this tag. Can't put that in my thing because I wrecked it. None of these tags are the kind of tags I, that I would put in my thing because that's not the kind I'm using, but I will. Anyway, um, so she got lucky. I didn't get so lucky, but that's okay. You can't always win, right? So, um, let's see. Let me clean over there but we went to that art place I don't know the name of it 
but it's oh this is also this else came from this is what else I bought at the thrift store before you were born and I just looked over and I saw this and I thought oh, isn't that pretty isn't that cute and then I flipped through it and look at this you guys it's so cute but wait till you see look aren't these adorable I had to have this and this is the main reason she looks like a mixed media girl, doesn't she? She's amazing. She's really pretty. So I had to have this. It's very mixed media -y. mixed media e. So I'm not sure what I'm gonna do with it yet. But I am going to just keep it and figure out some 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 figure out something to do with it. Isn't that cute? Oh, that's so sweet. So yeah, a cute little butterfly. Very cute. So I had to have that. Okay. So we did go to that art place and it's called Art Swap. Swap Art. Art Art Swap. For Art Swap. I don't remember, but I got some stuff. First off, I found this. Now, discover the world of inks, papers, and beyond an altered journey. And this is a um, DVD from Tim Holtz. It was a buck. Um, so yeah, I thought, oh, well, look at this some night, you know, or some day, whatever, you know, so it's a CD, so I got that for a buck, and I found this for three dollars, you guys, this is one that I do not have, I don't even know what year this was, this is uh, winter of 2010, um, so you know, I love this art journaling, uh, magazine I always have, I have a, quite a few of, no, I don't have quite a few, I have four or five of them, but they're all put away, packed up, so now I have one to play with and look at, and I do love this magazine a lot. I really, really love this magazine a lot. So I'll be playing with this magazine for three bucks. Can't beat that. And then I found, this. you guys are gonna laugh when you see this. Oh, oh, first off, these are cool. These were $2. And look at, there are these pins. They're like hat pins, but they're, huge and I thought these would be cool to stick in a journal you know just yeah I'll stick these in some journals that I'm gonna sell who doesn't want one of these is you know a hat pin aren't they cool I just thought these were the neatest things so I got got those I don't want to open them right now you can see them then I found this chain because I don't have a lot of chains this is a gold chain it's kind of thick but it's okay this was two dollars that's a nice chain, guys. I don't know how expensive chain is, but I thought for $2, I love it. I can use that, right? I don't know if it's too thick or too thin. It might be a little thick, but it's okay. It's gold, and it's pretty. I'm sure it'll come in handy someday. And then I found this peace sign necklace. My daughter actually found this, and she goes, Mom, because she knows I love peace signs. So I found this, and so I love that. So that I'm probably going to end up using as a charm. Okay, you guys are going to die when you see this. This is so funny. So this place is called the Art Swap or whatever. I'll get the real name of it from my daughter for you. It's in Santa Barbara. I don't even know what street it is. And they have bins and bins and bins of all kinds of stuff. I mean, you name it, they have it. Material, paper, whatever. So I reached into this bin, and the girl that runs the place, or at least is manager, because she was giving me the prices of everything, was working next to me. And I reached into this bin and I pulled this out. And I said, wow. I said, H how much is this? You know, because, I mean, I'm not going to sit here and go through this and try to um, go through this, you know. And she said, well, I don't know. She says, I go, yeah. I said, that's quite the job right there. You guys, look at, these were $2 a piece if you wanted to dig out a necklace. But look at all these charms. They're just adorable, right? And I love this. I love that. That can be used for so many things. Little charms. It's so cute. Little dove. Super cute. I just love this. And I think they're all the same, which I don't mind. Nice silver chains. There's some different things on here. Like, this is different, right? Some of them have different. I think, yeah, see? Some of them have different, because that's different. You know, so some of them are different. Oh yeah, this is a little different. But, so these were marked $2 a piece. I just saw, uh, see, two bucks. But I said, well, I'm not gonna dig through this. She goes, well, how about the whole stack for six bucks? And I said, 
Okay. I mean, $6, you guys, and look at all this chain. I don't know if this chain is going to work for me. I don't know if it's thin or thick, but look at all these things. You know, there's those, and I mean, I, I probably won't uh, try to undo these. I'll just cut them up and use these as I need them and harvest them as I go. I just thought this was a great find for $6, right? So we got that. So that's cool. Okay, then the next thing I got was, or is, uh, two more things. This is really cool. I thought, wow, if I wanted to make a um, journal, uh, I could use this as like the whole, like, I could make a couple, two or three different journals out of this, actually. Now that I'm looking at it, because it's bigger. And then I could just, they could be, it could be mix or match. So this whole thing was two bucks. And this is, isn't this amazing? It all just kind of goes. So I can make two or three butterfly journals and uh, sell them as a little set or sell them, you know how I do sometimes. So I loved this. So I got this um, vintage slate, vintage. So this whole thing was two bucks. She was like the two. She goes, I'm just the $2 person today. I said, that's okay with me. And then the last thing I got, I didn't find a lot, a lot, but I found enough. You know, I couldn't spend a lot of money today, so I didn't, there was a lot of stuff in there that I didn't want to spend a lot of money on. Then I found these. And I thought these were cool. I have a lot of, um, uh, what do I have? I have a lot of wallpaper, but I don't have this upholstery pa paper or uh, material, which I was going to get some from one of the men, you know, down the Oh, see, that comes off there, it wrecks it. I guess you have to use a, um, see, and that's why I'm not too keen on this because I don't know how, if, I wonder if I would have, because it's really on there, you guys. So you're kind of limited to what you can do with this unless I can heat this blow with a blow dryer and see if it'll pull off. That's what I plan on doing. But anyway, if, if not, I mean, I can just glue it with this onto some projects and who's going to see that right nobody's going to see this so it'll just be what it is so i just i couldn't pass it up for two dollars you know so seriously i just you know i don't know what i'm going to do with it maybe make some material tags i'm going to sew it on stuff you know it just gives me a whole like look at that what's this oh that's pretty it just gives me a whole bunch of um other stuff to use you know some really cool Ooh, look at that yeah, these are going to make some cool tags. We are going to make some tags. Let me show you the other one really quick. And Gracie's like, what are you doing up there? There's no room for me. I think this is cute with little buttons, sort of. So let's flip through this one really quick. So yeah, it was a good day, you guys. And now I'm really tired and I just want to relax. I don't know if I'm going to be doing any art tonight. Um, I just do. I'm kind of tired. I'm, my daughter had some, you know, some things that she needed to talk through and... Oh, look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Won't that make a cool tag or two? That's neat. And I love this, too. So, you know, it's always emotional. Then when we leave, you know, there's the tears. and I just miss her so much already, you know. It's just, it's kind of hard. These It's hard any at any time to let your kid go. Look at this. is very zen, very Asian. I think I'll use that in my journal. I have got to start a Buddha journal for myself. I really do, you guys. That's gorgeous, that bird is upside down, but that's okay. So, oh, I love that. So, yeah, I might just, like, take one that I don't like very much, you know, which is going to be kind of hard to find, and try, to, like something like this, and try to sew it on a tag and see how it does, you know? And then just have, like, coordinating tags, you know? Material. I might just do that. I just think that's so cool. And sew some buttons on there and whatever. Just, you know. So I had to have this for two two dollars a piece. I couldn't couldn't pass it up. So there's my haul, and that was my day. And I hope you guys enjoyed it. And I will talk to you very soon. Okay, bye guys. Oh, oh wait, 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 before you go, I'm now going to add on a little bit of the drive that I drove home, okay? Because I, I turned on my camera for a minute on the drive home. I didn't have a lot to say or anything. I'm probably going to repeat some of the stuff that I said just now. But um, 
I just wanted you to see, it was very foggy, but it was still really cool because you could see the palm trees and some of the ocean. So I hope you enjoy that, that little ride with me. All right, that's it. I'll talk to you guys really soon. Bye guys. Hi guys, I'm on my way back from Santa Barbara and I just thought I would take a quick little, um, this is a pretty, this is the 101, obviously. And it's really kind of foggy and it was beautiful um, up there today. But, oh, look, at there's a train. Cool, the Amtrak. Anyway, um, it was a really nice day with my kid, and I thought I was going to film more, but that didn't happen. I ended up just spending so much quality time with her that, you know, pulling out my camera just, you know, was not part of the gig. So the ocean is out there. I don't know if you can see it, but it's, like I said, it's really foggy. And, um, so, yeah, but, yeah, you have that, it's the ocean, right? But, um, and we had a great day, uh, isn't it quieter in my car now? Because this is a new car, this is a different car, so, yeah, it's quieter. See the ocean a little bit? I guess you can see it in that distance there. I hope you can. Um, we should be heading into Ventura here shortly, and that'll be kind of cool. I'm just going to film a little bit. Probably, I'm going to probably add this to an end of a video tonight. I have a haul that I probably just showed you and uh, told you that I would put this on the end, hopefully. Um, and so if you want to stick, if I said, I'll tell you if you want to stick around for a little bit of a uh, drive down the 101. We call it the Pacific Coast Highway, which is the 101. Um, this is it. This is the drive. And normally it's not foggy, like ever. Like when we, in San Francisco, the 101 is always foggy, but not here. This is this is uh, this is different. This is unique. But oh, I'm tired. We had a long day. You know, um, what did we do? I went up. I took her to lunch like right away, and then I took her shopping, and we popped some tags, and we went to that art store. It's called Scrap of Art or Art art scraps or something like that and um by now you've already seen what I got there right it's great so I probably already told you all this so I don't know what else I'm going to tell you right now except for um I don't know <laughs> uh, I'm tired that's for sure it was a long day I started out at the AAA getting my car registered to me and paying tag money and oh my god all this sometimes it just you know it's like okay Enough is enough. I had fun today, though. I really enjoyed my day with my kid today. And I give her Easter basket a day early. Um, I always give her an Easter basket. And I usually fill it with things that she can, you know, use. You know, perfume. Well, more like body sprays and razors and makeup and sponges and, you know, socks. <laughs> okay, I put some eggs and some chocolate in there, too. I didn't give her any money this time because dad's going to give her some money. He's probably going to come up and go golfing with her tomorrow. and So, yeah, we're going to be heading into Ventura here pretty soon. So, I just want you to see that and then I'll be done. So, this is Ventura, next seven exits. But, yeah, so, God, I just love spending time with my kid, you guys. I really miss her. See the coast over there? I really do miss her. Um, we're coming up on the Ventura County Fairgrounds. Oops, see. So, there's always tears when we leave, and she's under a lot of pressure right now. There's like 10 girls, 11 girls that live in the place, and they don't all get along, and, you know, it's, she got along with everybody at first, and now she doesn't, and there's always the one that they have to pick on, and right now, unfortunately, she's the one. So, girls will be girls. We all know that, right? So, drama. See the palm trees over there, they're pretty. So, anyway, let's see. And I told her today, I said, you know, whatever you feel, I feel. You know, here's some pretty trees. And, um, so yeah, I'm just going to go over there. I'm not looking, but I'm showing you what's over there. Um, so, and so I just, I hate it. I don't want her to have to move out of this house because there's a very, you know, on the left up here, there's a very, um, that Ventura sign there, it's kind of blue. It's like a, what do they call it? It's been there forever. Historical landmark. Right there. Oh, yeah. Historic Ventura.
Ventura. Someday I'm, I've taken you to Ventura. We'll do it again sometime. Um, I don't know. I feel for her. You know, it's got to be hard. You know, first year out of college. First year out of the house. Playing sports. Um, having a full load. Having a job. You know, she's got it. You know, I hope that when I come up there and I take her shopping and um, you know, we don't spend a lot of money. We find, you know, I bought her a couple bathing suits. They were like $11 a piece, you know, and we t went to the thrift store and she found some cute clothes and took her to CVS and got her some makeup and, um, you know, popped some tags at the thrift stores and stuff. Oh my gosh, you guys, one of the thrift stores, I probably already told you this, but I'm going to tell you again just in case I forget. Um, they had two bags of junk jewelry. One bag was $189. Oh, excuse me, guys. I'm so tired. And the other bag was $99. Big, big bags. Like like twice, like two big gallon bags. Like two gallon bag bags, right? Two gallons a piece, right? But $200, I was like, oh my God, no way. So I asked them, do they ever go half off? Even half off would be a lot, right? No, I was looking for junk jewelry today and then I did find this, um, oh, I did find something, you've probably already seen it, my my wad of chains and charms. Oh my God, that was a good deal. Six bucks at that art place. So I hope you, saw, hope you saw that already. Anyway, okay, well we're through um, Ventura and there's the palm trees and now it's just gonna be a lot more fog and freeway. So I just wanted to show you a little bit on the car and um, isn't it nice and quiet? You guys compared to my last car, you probably don't realize it, but my last car was so loud. I mean, cause the air was getting in cause the door was ajar cause it was wrecked. And there was a dent on the side that kept the door, the door always ajar. But anyway, okay, so um, this will probably be closing up the whole video. Oopsie. So with that, I will close, and I hope you guys all have a happy Easter. Okay. Talk to you guys later. Bye now.